I was uh, recently elected uh, as the president of the European Bowling Union. The exciting news is that since I was elected, I managed with the help of uh, the Israeli Association to bring the European Championship in 2015 to Israel. It's actually the first time that Israel is hosting uh, any international tournament in bowling. There are eight clubs all over the country. Uh, Jerusalem, Netanya, Haifa, uh, Kiryat Ono, Savion, uh, Ramat Gan and Ranana. We are the largest uh, club and in our club there are about 100 uh, members now. The game actually is uh, popular among all ages. It's a type of sport that uh, doesn't require extreme physical training or anything like that. Uh, it's more mental and social. אני שמח להתארח בתוכנית שלכם, המועדון שלנו קיים מזה כ-35 שנים. הוא נוסד בעיקר על ידי יהדות דרום אפריקה, שבאו לארץ, שהיו רגילים למשחק הזה, הקימו מועדון לתפארת, וכיום למעשה הדור הולך ומתחלף. אני הנשיא הראשון של דרום דרום אפריקה ישראל במועדון הזה, ועדיין יש לנו המון חמורים דרום אנגלוסקסים, ואנחנו משחקים כמו שאתם רואים ברקע. מספר פעמים בשבוע לתועלת כולם, זה מועדון חברתי שאנשים נהנים להיות פה ולשחק בו. This is a, a hobby for most people, profession for others, that is extremely exciting, something that if you start, it catches you and in most cases you become addicted and you, in most cases, and you, you, you can hardly live without it. I've been a member of this club for the last three and a half years when I came back to live in Israel from England. It's a marvelous club, very sociable, very competitive, and we'd like more members to join, so come and join us. Bowls is a wonderful game. Firstly, it's for the elderly, it's a relaxing game, it's for the youngsters. At one stage, this club had 300 members, 300 members, and it was a wonderful club, it's still a wonderful club. Whoa! This is one of the most exciting sports there is for players and for those who understand the game and watch it. This game can be anywhere between an hour and a half and three hours. The principle of the game is you and your opposition have your own balls that are marked differently so you can identify who has which balls. You can put a blocker to your opposition, you can play with tactics, you have to think all, all game long. We go back and forth, uh, whoever reaches 21 points uh, first, he's the winner. The balls have a bias. At first it will go in a straight line and when it slows down it will go in an arc. You can throw it uh, forehand so you will go straight and bend to the left and if you uh, take the bias to the other side you will go straight and then have an arch to the right. Lawn balls is actually one of the least expensive uh, entertainment you can have or hobbies. The game has changed recently. The games now is being played in sets so the game became more interesting, dynamic and shorter. We have night balls, so we, especially in the summertime, we play in the, at night with floodlights. This game is so exciting that it's a shame that it's not popular in Israel. We welcome everybody and anybody that comes to play. Training pretty much takes a few lessons and off you go. Mm -hmm.